Good morning, ladies. My name is Chaz, and welcome to the What If Zuku Was Muted. The official name of it is called What If Zuku Was Muted and Was Overpowered. So, yeah. So, this is what it is. This is what's going down. The Zuku is born with a special power that allows him to basically, he has no weakness in this alternate timeline. Yeah, and plus he was also born with a quirk called Limit. So, yeah. And we'll get into, like, the bad side first. Like, the... It will be, like, continue the same storyline. But, as my other, like, what ifs. And I'm also thrown in Zoomy, so, yeah. In some of these parts. But not very often. Hmm. Okay, so, yeah, the, so let's begin with Zuku and Zumi were born, and of course, at age of four, they go to Quirk Doctor. Oh, and I almost forgot before we start the video. I am going to add to Inko a special power, like quirk, that allows her to take away voices. Like, a person's voice will be taken away. Similar to All for One, but with the take away the voice instead of a quirk. So, yeah. So, Zuku ends up. Er, so, Zumi. Er, so, the quirk doctor looks at Zumi first. Here. Looks at Zumi. And. Said tells her that she has a quirk, a fire manipulation thing. And then the when he looks at Zuku, tells him that he doesn't have a quirk, and he can't become a hero, and yeah, all that stuff. So before. No, after they left the doctor's office, they go to the aim back to their house. Inko decides to take away Zuku's voice. You know that one anime where the main character can't comment anything? Like, forget her name, but that anime. So, yeah, but it's for Zuku. So, Zuku you know, walks around the house all creepily because since his mother took away his voice, he only has to do sign language, and no one in that family knows sign language. So... He, of course, leaves, or he left, the Midoriya family, and he can't talk to anyone. So what does he do? He basically walks around um, the, or he lives in the dumpster thing. And 
But he still has, like, motions things. I am not going to give the removing his emotions, like, to, like, anyone else. I'm only doing, like, a voice thing. So, yeah. Zuku, or so Zumi goes to UA. Zuku, who can't basically say anything. He couldn't go, he couldn't even go to UA, or he couldn't even go to school because they, they want you, they want to hear your, their thoughts, like use their voice. But Zuko doesn't have a voice. So, he lives out in the roads, and no one, I mean no one, knew that Zuko is overpowered. He has a limit quirk, but he, he has nothing to show for it. So, yeah. Zuku ends up... Um, 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 saying... Or, actually... So, let's do time skip. From 4 to... You know, 15. So, yeah. During all the time, Zuku, who is so quiet, he doesn't even how much stress he is going through. Who? He, his parents even doesn't even notice that he's gone. But the only people that do, didn't notice... Or everyone didn't notice that he... So, he lives in the dumpster. And he goes... Or his, like, sister goes to UA. And... Yeah. So, she does the quirk test. And I'm skipping all the way through to the... All my verse. All for one... As Zuku, who could hear Erm um, Lang all for one, mm. and he of course had a building drop on him, like bang him. So when he was, yeah, sleeping. As all for one didn't notice that Zuku wasn't quirkless, but instead he wasn't interested in his quirk anyways. It was his power that he was that he was seeking as all might or as all for one said before I kill you there's one thing that, oh, or one of the people that was born in this world oh, that I have my sights on. And you know what it is? Is all my... The kid, his name, him is Zuko Midoriya. He uh, had has what I want. The power of the infinity power. Like he. He was born. As he says. He was born with the infinity power. And zero. But only things. There's two things that keeping him. From going all. Like all the way through. Who. Like. Accepting that power is. One is his quirk limit. The quirk doctor told him, 
or the good doctor told him that the he was quirkless, but that was a lie. He Zuku wasn't quirkless at all. He had a limit quirk that allows him to limit himself. No. Oh. Oh, on his powers. Powers. He didn't... Mm, or, and Zasashi couldn't believe it. He, because he was there. He could not believe that the quirk doctor lied to him. About his son. Not... Not having a quirk thing like... Yeah, that was a lie, though. Yeah. So, Zuku, who wasn't quirkless at all. And Zuku, whose entire body was under a rubble. As he could hear or a charging sound. It was his power, infinity, <clears throat> as all for one turns his entire body, looks away from All Might, as he could, he could feel the aura of the, he's already here. <laughs> he's under that rubble. Now, come on out. And Zuku uses, or he, because he was unconscious, or like, he was like knocked out. His body is reacting to it. So when his body reacted, he looked like the like how Super Saiyan Ian's like go all like make the ground shuffle. As a beam of light pierced right through the skies. As. As the most powerful entity. As Zuku's eyes widen. But it was. It was like. His eyes were rainbow colored. Like infinity flames. As he looks at all for one. Hun. As everyone. Huns is watching in horror. As they couldn't believe. This kid's the anime kid. Or no. no let me rephrase it. This kid is the. Most. Overpowered character. In. Everything. You you thought the he one of the DC characters was overpowered like all of them are overpowered. Well, oh, Zuku, ew, is or actually using Marvels and DCs is. Overpowered characters in those two are that overpowered. Well, Zuku surpassed them. He he is so powerful that he could see into the future, past, present, everything all at once, and and plus he is connected. To the entire multiverse. So his power is on a whole nother level. As buildings starts to change into the fingers. Or like hands coming out of the ground. As it's attacking all for one. And as he, as Zuku, if he had a voice, he would have had... This to say, 
You'll die by my hand, all for one. You're gonna suffer through this painful. As, yeah, it was pretty scary. As, as all the building hands, the, like, the hands made out of buildings, starts grabbing all for ones, or tries to grab him, as all for one, Hun, is like, dodging his attacks, as, then, the time came, because Zuka was connected to the entire multiverse, Earth, Zuku, or he could summon out, like, alternate versions of himself if he wanted to. So, all for one is like, give me that power! As a monsterish hand comes out of nowhere, grabs all for one's wrist before her. Her and breaks the wrist, and you know what came out of the portal? One man that could kill all for one. Hun, an entire her universe. One man, and that could kill Superman, and is. None other than Doomsday Zuku. Yeah. Doomsday Zuku was like breaks all for one's hand as he comes through the portal. As. But he has a voice. So. But it's deep, dark, scary voice. Hmm. <clears throat> Looks like my master, or my, yeah, my master, her, 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 wanted me to kill you, who, all for one. So I will fulfill his promise. So, as he turns his head, leave it to me, Zuku. No, and get prepared. As Zuku, who looks at him with with a power, yeah. So, yeah, Zuku is this powerful. He he could not even apprehend the. How powerful he really gets when he. Yeah. So. Zuko teleports everyone into his pocket universe. So that the. As. Except for Doomsday Zuko and. All for one. And him. So Zuko uses his power. You know that how. Dragon Ball Z characters that do, like, spirit bombs. Well, Zuku could conjure up a black hole, hole spirit bomb. And you don't know what it is, so I'll explain it. It's a more, like, a upgraded version of a spirit bomb that could destroy the entire galaxies. And uh, see, like... The space, time, reality, mind, soul, everything. Hing. Hing. Without any, any pow. So, everyone in the pocket universe that of his that's not affected by it was, yeah. So Zuku uses his power 
Knower as Doomsday Zuku was softened up the all for one. Yeah, and Zuku uses it as the entire planet, the entire universe, everything was gone except for him um, and the his pocket universe. As the everyone is watching in horror, as how powerful this kid really gets to, <clears throat> as the court doctor tells Inko that the whatever, sorry, when Zuku or when. Like a court doctor tells Zuk or Inko and Asashi that what all for one said was the truth. I lied to both of you. Huh. Huh. Yeah. So, Zuku who had enough power to destroy that much, huh? As everyone's like, you should have told us as as Inko and Asashi are mad at the quirk doctor. Asashi even punched the quirk doctor in the face. He's so that the as he starts using his if, if the if you told us earlier that Zuku had this much power, Inko wouldn't stole his voice. Anyways. Because, and you lied to us about him not having a quirk that's keeping him stable from, I mean, how do you feel as, or as Hasashi's Really upset as everyone's trying to hold him back, as Endeavor er, isn't gonna let him like because Endeavor knows that he's in um, he couldn't even talk about it because one, his his planet is destroyed. Our entire galaxy, uh, galaxy was destroyed, and the only people that only humans that were left in his pocket universe is, or everyone, yeah. So Zuku, who, who, or Doomsday hey Zuku says, I'm gonna head back to my home. Yeah. As he uses telepathy to tell Z Doomsday Zuko that, okay. As he creates a portal, opens up. As, as Doomsday Zuko says the, to him that you're the best alternate version of, of us, us. Hey, we should all just hang out on your world. Really? As, yeah. So, now it is time for him. So, he uses his beam of light. Light of creation. As he creates the entire multiverse. Or brings everything back. Yeah. Yeah. As he puts the people back onto their home worlds. Or back to their, like, planet, multiverse, everything. And Zuku... No, couldn't even still can't speak because... As he was that powerful that he lands... 
ends. As everyone was looks at him, or everyone like, <clears throat> and even the um the that guy that goes ha 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 ha, or actually, Principal Nezu tells every pro hero to keep their watchful eye out. For Zuku Midoriya. Oh. Uh, that includes you all might. Ain't. As yeah. Because. The Zuku. Is that powerful? Huh? All might believes that. Of course. Zuku. Or no. Actually. All Might tells Zumi, or asks Zumi, you, you, you know your, where your brother usually goes to? No. Um, because since he got his voice thing, he usually, like, he would be, like, standing here one minute, and then he will be gone the next minute. He's like, yeah. Okay. Hmm. Well, if if we can't find him, and if the villains are, as Razumi understands, like cuts him off, and says, "I understand that the, but um, I know my brother better than anyone. The he wouldn't join like a villains. He would join the pro heroes." Hmm. As even everyone, and I mean everyone, like all the pro heroes and all the students, made Zuku the top priority to be found. Because, yeah, that made him more important than anyone yeah Zuku is scary so one thing that always like or Zumi walks around with like class A and class B because as the Guy with a copy quirk, the one that that annoying guy from Class One B. If you guys don't know what I'm talking about, he is in Class One B, and he is right here. This guy right here was making a comment of, "Huh, so what? Is it? We all have the quirks that can basically do hit." As one of them knocks him outside of a head, as he's, or as they said, he's a more important, and and then the or we people like all for one will steal our quirks and use them for like his evil or their evil schemes. But Zuku was born with a power that can never be stolen by a normal person. If so, they he will be dead in about five minutes. Whoever stole the quirk or power. And I understand that. It's just the... If he's that powerful, you seem... Or as... The class representative, this one, she tells him that the, or she tells him that, and you, you, you want, or I know that in class one, a Momo and Rozu doesn't, mm, or she could create stuff from her body. 
funny because she has creation, but you don't see her making like entire galaxies. You saw it. We all saw it. As everyone's like, yeah, we all agree. If he's that powerful and. But one thing that really bothers me as the copy kid says, one thing that was bothering me is the that spike monster. What do you mean? Did you ever notice that they he the that creature her called Zuku Master? Huh? Huh? Hmm. Yeah. As Pony says, yeah. The and I heard that the name him like he introduces himself to all for one like they have met before her the and what was his name as the beast guy or as or actually dark shadow says or actually, it was Doomsday Huizuku. As everyone froze, like, wait, you knew that what that creature's name is? Yeah. When, <clears throat> because, because there's, a, when they both, who were talking, my, or I heard that the, you're a best alternate version of us, <laughs> ever, Zuku, so let's all hang out together, you know, on your world. There must be m multiple versions of him, that are, like, has, Way more power. There might be. Like. An alternate version of. All of us. Yes. Like. As everyone. Says. Maybe you're right. He. Me. If. If he has that much power and connects to the and has the power to contact with other alternate versions of himself, he must be that powerful. Powerful. As All Might was listening to the conversation, Nation. With, like, Mr. Aizawa and the, yeah, the Endeavor. As everybody starts talking about him, and Zuko gets up, they're actually... As Tenya says that if Zuku is this much powerful and that must be just a, his power and its fullest that we just witnessed. As Sir Nidai says, yeah, yes, the, he, he must have, have the deepest connection to the multiverse. Because since after his power fully activated. Activated. Then the. 
I couldn't even predict the future anymore. Like someone just blocked it. As even Stars and Stripes. Him. 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 Couldn't even like. Because she knows that. If some villains tries to deal Zuku for their selfish needs. And Zuku creates an island. For only him to enjoy as he creates a kingdom. As he doesn't. Or he has all the. He created the entire multiverse books. Like. We only could read one book at a time. Or create one book at a time. Well. With Zuku, create infinite amount, like endless amount, and has endless storage in his pocket universe, too. So he has all the knowledge of the entire universe, multiverse, everything, and he has the power of the Infinity and zero. That allows him to manipulate the everything. He can see into the future, past, present, everything. And a fourth. He has the connection to the entire alternate versions of himself. So... Like a female Zuku who, who he can, like, he could go on a date with her. Like, basically, you're dating yourself and getting married to yourself. No thing. If he wanted to, but he knows it's weird. He, cr he even created a alternate version of himself as the um, one who sees all. Or like something more powerful than anyone. So Zuku been there, done that, been there, done that. So, yeah. So, Zuku ends up having... So... He sets up for if they do come and visit with him. And, yeah. So, it was time for them... To basically. So, Zu or so Zumi could tell that they looked everywhere. But it was in a remote location. So they went and checked. And it, Zuku was there. As they begged him to come back to the... Home and yeah, so as he as Zumi forgot that, as she says, as this. I we keep, gosh dang it, I for, keep forgetting. What? He doesn't talk, remember? Oh. He could hear us, but we can't hear him. Be 
because of my mother, or because our mother stole his voice. As, yeah. So, Inko was actually on a trip thing. And she came with them. Um, and, yeah. Then, Juku had enough power to destroy them all, but he he tilts his head as he telepathically tells them in their heads that why did you come? Um um, um because the is it the power that you seek? Because it is not worthy for you. As Hizumi says, no, no, we're not here for your power. We're here for you. Like, to take you home. The same home as Zuku telepathically says. The same home that took my voice away. And the... It's a blessing for her me to reveal my true power so I'm instructable you can't use your brainwashing quirk none of you could even defeat me without uh, any any like Oh. Sorry. So, yeah. As Inko shows up, um, and tell Ozuko that the she'll she apologize, or of course she will apologize to him about not knowing that they just abandon the most overpowered character in any floor mans. Basically, like, Zuku is the most overpowered character in this what if so far that I even made. As Inko, oh. Walks up slow to not spook him. Ezuku says, or in telepathically says, What are you doing, Inko? Yeah. As Inko tells her son that he probably needs. His own voice back. And Zuku. Is not. Not. Or doesn't need it. As. Inko. Says to him. Here I go. As she gave Zuku back his voice. But he can never, or he doesn't even use it. Still uses the telepathy. 
is everyone thought the him did it fail or did it like yeah or actually it didn't fail it's just the as Zuko telepathically tells him it didn't fail but after it's been so like long you, and you trained your entire body as he says you trained your own entire body on you for what the Yeah. As he says, you train your own body to not speak. Just use telepath every single day. I'm used to it. As, yeah. So... Yeah. Zuku ends up um telling them that he's used to that relying on telepathically a whole bunch as the as Inko was can't believe that he used like the telepathy to talk through the entire life. So yeah, Zuku ends up mm -hmm. so Yeah. So Zuku or so Zumi runs up up to him and tells him that he want or she wants to hear his beautiful voice, not the telepath thing. Please. And she's begging him to use his actual voice that comes from his, his, like, like, his actual voice tell old him, or, so when he did that, of course he says, Okay. And Zuku uses his voice. And she's so, like, happy to have her brother back. The most overpowered character is powerful enough uh, to wipe villain from the face of the planet if he wants to. But it will get boring after a certain time thing. So, yeah. So then Zuku hugs his sister. And, yeah. As he says, you know, I have this all set up for if they do come. Right. Mm -hmm. If they come and visit. As they all walked out. Uh, 
Um, and, of course, Momo wants to ask Zuku if about the simple question. I mean, who was that guy that called you master? The one that had spikes. All of us, rest of us wanted to know. Oh, that. <clears throat> oh, do you mean Doomsday Zuku? It's a long story, but name. I will tell you. Come sit. As they, as chairs comes up. As he explains the entire story, I do not have time for it. So, if you want to, you could always go up on to YouTube and type up what if Zuku was Doomsday aim. I think one shot. That's what the full title is. And, yeah, he basically, eh, give a huge shout out to him. He'll probably in the comments, or he'll be in the description, or the, like, any other thing. So, yeah. So, Basically, yeah. So, after the... Then, <clears throat> and the other, like, students asked him a bunch of questions, like, is there alternate versions of all of us, like, as you? Yeah. It's, it is true. There is a, there's a lot of alternate versions of myself with, like, your quirks. And most of them um, are stronger than, so yeah. So, if you guys are so, plus, so Momo decides this is, it's a personal question for him. So, she walks up to him and tells him that he, or of course, before, I forgot to mention, so at this point, he is now unmuted. Basically, I'm saying like he is no longer being the that person, this one, that girl right here, right there, this one right here, the one that this one that says. Came, can't comment or whatever. Well, yeah, he is no longer that. So now he has a voice. Yes, and so everyone and is like, or Bakugo is like, huh, yeah. And I can't believe that you're the most powerful person in the world, Zuku. You outshine all of us with your overpowered stuff. So, overhaul oh, oh thing was got skipped. So, I'm skipping the overhaul fight because Zuko automatically won that round. 
And, yeah. So, basically, yeah. So, I'll do a next part, is part two. And it is going to be crazy. How crazy? It is super crazy. In part two. Oh. Where it is. Okay. So. Peace out in this video. And see you in part two. So.